We're a little over halfway through the college basketball season and one local team is quietly putting together a nice year. Clayton Castle has more on the Central Lakes women's college basketball team. We have a lot more girls than last year. Last year we were six to seven on a good day and this year we're about 10 so it's nice that we have enough to scrimmage each other. 2016-17 was a rough season for the Central Lakes College women's basketball team in terms of depth and numbers. Most games only six would dress due to injuries or other adverse situations. But this year the Raiders not only have the depth and the numbers to back up its 11-4 start, but it also has the team chemistry both on and off the court. It's how well we bond and we just all get along so we, I think we play for each other more than we do. I mean, we all love the sport, obviously, but we all love being with each other and we push each other to be better. And it's a lot more fun because we do get along and we do bond with each other. Like, we're a pretty tight-knit team to where this is the closest I've been with my teammates. I'm, I wasn't close with my teammates like this in high school, so, I mean, it's pretty special with these group of girls. On the court, the team knows how to score points, averaging 71.9 points, 40 rebounds, and 17 assists per game. On the stat sheet, though, you'll notice that the strength of the offense is not one particular player. Offense is pretty good. Like We are a pretty deep team. We have shooters, we have drivers, we have assisters, we have posts, that, like strong posts that can just go up and make everything look easy, so it's, it's fun. If the Raiders want to make a run in March, however, the team will need to improve an already stout defense. As the saying goes, defense wins championships. It's on the defensive end of the floor, and this team has shown they can really uh, play defense. And, and uh, again, it's something that can come and go. You've got to really be ready to work at it every day. The Raiders have a big weekend coming up as they face Rainy River and Hibbing Community Colleges. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Thanks, Clayton. As he said, Rainy River Friday night, 530, then Hibbing Saturday afternoon at 1. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.